The West. A land of opportunity. Adventure. A place where you can be a hero, a scoundrel, and anything in between. Play your cards right, and coming out here could be the best thing that ever happened to you. If you can survive, that is. Because here's the thing. This ain't quite the Wild West as you know it. There are ancient powers at war with each other. Strange entities lurking in the dead of night with their own rules and their own peculiar motives. No matter which side you take, you better watch yourself. Don't get me wrong. Rewards are waiting for those who are brave enough to unveil the mysteries out here in the land of opportunity. But opportunity can come at a pretty high price. Welcome to the Weird West. How's it going? My name is K.Y. Wiley, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're playing Weird West. This game looks really cool. It's an RPG game. That's all I really need to tell you because the intros probably told you most of what this game is going to be. It's a weird western style game. And you heard what they said about it, monsters and all that stuff. And Yeah, that was a pretty cool intro. Um, this is a top-down RPG, so... It's kind of like old school Fallout style, but not the same kind of combat. It's got um, real time combat. So it's interesting. I've never seen anything like this. I like the art style and all that. And it comes from the devs who made Dishonored and Prey. And I really like those games, so let's give it a go. I'm excited. Okay, those are just tips. Let's go. Let me guess, friend. No idea who or where you are, right? Sorry about that. A necessary part of the process. Brand's ready. Then it's time. Off you go. We're counting on you. Ooh. That hurt. That's a cool symbol. Your journey begins. Difficulty normal. Tutorials on. Language English. Sure. All right. Let's see. Whoop. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. <clears throat> How is it going, dude? All right. Let's go. Somewhere in the weird west. Used to be, you were one of the most feared bounty hunters in all the west. But you gave that up, buried your irons, traded them for a normal life. Sounds good to me. Tonight, though, that's all going to change. Oh, no. Destiny's calling, and it ain't taking no for an answer. Why is Destiny always got to be calling? Just want to live a nice, humble life. The hell's that? You ain't taking our land, monster. Not after land. Take the adult, kill the kid, no meat on the bones. Now let's move. Law's coming. In the air. Oh. Your son dead in the dirt outside. Shit. Like you've been branded with a cattle iron. Huck, Flood's Almighty can't be. I gotta find Jane. Jane? Jane? That sound is nothing in the background of my house. That is in the game. 
Sounds weird. Sounds like something in the back of my house. Jane, you're alive. Sheriff Flora Albright. Jane. Is that a guy or a girl? I think it's a girl. Right? I don't know. Jane heard gunshots from town, came running. It was those still water floods. Take them. It was those still waters. Floods take them. Looks like they hit every farm from here out to the Galeen's Crossing. They they killed your boy. We'll bury the bastards for what they've done. But I ain't seen your husband all along, so if they took him, we gotta move quick before the trail runs cold. Um, ask which way they went. We don't need to know who they are. We need to know where they went so we can kill them. I ain't seen where they went, but I got one of the Stillwater bastards alive back at the Grackle Jail. We can squeeze the dog for answers. Better grab your shooting irons, partner. Got a feeling we'll need him. Ask where to find a gun. Where do I find a gun? What? You forget? We buried your old revolver out back with the rest of your gear when you retired. Once you healed, meet me back at the jail. Look, I know you thought you was done with those bounty hunting days, but they ain't done with you. Let's head out. Here, take this portable relay. Newfangled, good for communication in case we got split up. Got to split up. I'd say welcome back, but I reckon I won't. Yeah, it's best you don't. Wow. Look at this art style. This is cool. It's pretty. Objective tracking. You get a new objective. A tracker will appear at the edge of your screen to lead you to the objective. Okay. Guess this is my son. I don't seem to be too upset about it. That's okay. I'm gonna take his teddy, y'all. Huck. Aw. And my dog. They gotta take the weird wolf. Take the meat, I guess. Seems weird. Take the chicken eggs. Got some chicken eggs and some feathers. Let's check the dog house. What do we got here? Uh, bones. Nice. Oh my god. Carry. <laughs> I can huck it. It can jump. What does shift do? Dodge roll. Oh, I got a shovel. You'll find plenty of buried treasure in the secret mound caches across the Weird West. That shovel might come in handy for digging up some of it, or for burying your dead. Got a key to the shed. Oh, is this the shed? Wow, it's right next to the where the key was. Hold E to unlock. Oh, we got a lot of shit here. Let's take all of it. Another shovel. Take another shovel. Take all the shovels don't think we gotta go this way oh I missed what that said oh well let's see it's empty I shouldn't have alright let's go over here let's dig get our gun back let's get our gun back and uh oh retrieve it okay yeah all right, that's good stuff, man. Been a while. Okay. Oh, this is cool. Very nice. That's a bit loud. That's okay. Do we have unlimited ammo? I guess we do, huh? Empty. Press R while aiming to reload. Okay. Oh. Let's get some meat off this piggy. 
Time to get moving. Travel to another location. Head to the edge of the area until you reach the area limits. Press E to open the travel map and select your destination. Cool. Corn. Give me that corn. Give me that corn. I wonder if this is anything like other arcane games, like how they would have things hidden up top. Hmm. Let's see. They crouch just like every game. Yep. They got ammo up here. Ooh. Things in the crate. That's nice. Alright, let's see. Um, what else can we find here in this place? Should I go to my house? See if there's anything else I can take? Another chicken egg? No? We already checked that? Let's make sure we got shit in the house that we need. We don't need pans, we don't need that. I don't think there's anything. Nope. Alright. I guess we can take off now. Let's go. Um, Grackle, because we need to go to the Grackle Gel and meet... Uh, I already forgot his or her name. Coyote attack. You encountered a couple of coyotes. Uh oh. Coyotes are not a fucking big deal at all. Even to people without a gun, so. This will go easy. Bang! Oh, this is kind of cool. Ooh, this is cool, dude. Is that it? Am I done? Why am I walking? Oh, did I hit caps? A knife. Uh, let's cook some steak, I guess. I don't know. Oh, cool. I healed myself, I guess. Suitcase. Travel supplies. You found raw food. Stop by location with a fire or a stove. Cook up a meal to generate some of your HP. Okay. Cool. Take some of that shit. Give me some pistol slugs. Carcass empty. I don't know why I keep searching empty things. Oh, dude, can I shoot the bird? Oh, damn. I got chicken wings. Mmm, love me some chicken wings. Meat. Alright, I think I'm gonna stop taking meat and get out of here now. <laughs> so each area is like a little map like this, I think. I mean, that's how it is so far. Alright, let's get to Grackle. Gotta go kill that fool in the jail. I'm not gonna have no mercy on that fool. He straight up shot my kid. I mean... I'm sure he's gonna eat my husband too, because he was talking about how much meat he had on him. Panic in the air. Folks hollering. Death and dirt. Ah, oh, there's a bunch of dead people everywhere. It's fucked up, man. Uh, be careful, not all items can be picked up without consequences. Other characters' belongings will be marked red. If you move to interact with them, the owner sees you stealing, your reputation might suffer. And you might even wind up in a jailhouse. That's no good. Did I just... Those birds have watermarks on them. Does that mean they're wet? I mean, obviously, but... I wonder if that has effect on combat and stuff like that. Blacksmith. Silver nugget. Great weapons and smelting ingots. Any copper, silver, gold nuggets you find or dig up with a pickaxe. During your adventures, can be either melted down to upgrade your weapons or turned into ingots at a blacksmith shop. Ingots can be resold for a better price. 
at the nearest bank. Just look for the ore buyer. All right, cool. That's good to know. What's in here? Nightstand, empty. Okay. Oh, I can zoom in, get a better look at things. Let's check here. Oh, horsies. Let's pat the horsey. Let's pat the horsey. Looks like I'm slapping him. <laughs> oh no, I'm just giving him a little touch. Like, hey, buddy. Oh, crate. I got a flannel rag. Can I wear it? No, it's junk. Junk, you found a junk item. One person's trash is another man's tre another person's treasure. Sell your junk at any general store and make some quick cash. Yeah, I get it. All right. Where? Oh. So the, the killing is done. No one's here still killing. I guess we can take dead people's stuff. Makes sense. Uh, I'll take that coin. Let's talk to you. Are you doing all right? You got your bounty hunter gear back on? I still hear the screaming. All right, looks like we can't like have a conversation with them. That's okay. Most games you can't do that. Why do I keep searching empty shit? Whoa. All right. What do you got? Nothing. All right, let's keep going. Maria Perez. Justin Hernandez. Are you alright? Mrs. Why'd they even attack us? We got nothing to take. I don't know. Sorry. Money. What are you having? I mean, it doesn't look like I'm having anything because there's nothing here. <laughs> oh, pocket watch. And coins. Thank you. The Western Gazette. Read news. 2nd of January. Let's see what it says. Sorry, I'm looking at my recorder. Make sure it's working. Owner of infamous lantern room brothel missing. It has recently been reported that the owner of the den of scandalous pleasures known as the lantern room near that wine-soaked town of Cedar Flats has been missing for some days now. Whether the man's dealings in sins of the flesh have caught up with him or some sinister forces at work is unknown. Readers are, as always, urged to avoid sin in order to preserve their righteous standing with the spirits. Sorry, that's my cat. Um, mind crawler scare at Rock Strip Hollow. What's a mind crawler? That sounds terrifying. Frightful news from Rock Strip Hollow, where diggers in the deepest shafts uncovered a nest of mine crawlers. A nest of them? That's terrifying. No more than three days before this writing, this news has been delivered to the Gazette via relay. We unfortunately have no information at this time as to whether the miners were able to solve the problem of this mine is lost, or the mine is lost. Caven claims three lives at Yeb's keepsake. Three innocent souls harvested by Yeb. The miners at Yeb's keepsake have sent notice of the deaths of three of their fellows and asked the devoted to pray for a safe journey out for their friends on the ebb tide. May the spirits take them gently on their final journey. Oh, okay. I was like, what? what's a yeb? But it's just the cave. Dang. A lot of bad news. Kind of depressing. But that's alright. I don't think this game's supposed to be all happy and fun. It's probably going to have some depressing shit. Because it's like a dark west game. I gotta say, the idea for this is really cool. Empty vial. I'm going to take some more empty vials. I'm sure we can make potions later or something like that. Doctor's bag. No, that's empty. Ugh. Bandage. I'm just taking all this shit and they're suffering. 
let's talk to this guy. You alright? Blood everywhere. Right, let's revive him. Ah, how you doing? Hey, watch it. I just revived you. I'm trying to talk to you. How you doing, man? Are you alright? Bedroll pickup. Cool. How are you doing? Your irons. Guess we should call you Bounty Hunter again. Hey, come here. Where are you going? They didn't even take anything. All they wanted was people. Sorry. Open. Is this the jail? Rifle rounds. Cool. Shotgun. Nice. Spurs. I'm sure that's junk I can sell. Dynamite. Oh, that's something I can use. You've had some dynamite. Equip throwable projectiles by holding left alt while aiming. Where you can throw projectiles. Okay. Good to know. <clears throat> Good to know. What's in here? Stained cloth. Junk. I mean, I'll just sell it. Cool. It's cool with me. Dynamite. Dynamite's always good to get. You can always use dynamite. Let's get a better view of the place. Oh, there's the jail, I'm assuming. Let's go check out the doctor's office, though. I want to look around some places and find some shit, you know? Medicinal instructions. Ye modern herbal for warts, pleurisy, and other maladies. A viper's bite, strange proposal for extracting the venom by means of fowls. Let a living cock be procured, and let the anal extremity be applied to the wound, and so held. This will extract the venom. This is a good plan. What the fuck? I don't know what I just read, but I'm gonna just pretend like I didn't read that. Something about cock and anal. Whatever, man. Coins, thank you. I'm just robbing the dead. I mean, they're dead. They can't use it. I'm better off using it, alright? I get that it seems like I'm a bad person for taking things from dead people. But, I mean, like I said, honestly, they're dead. They can't use it anymore. What are they going to do with it, dude? A little hammer. I'll take it. Oops. Didn't mean to pause the game. This map seems a bit bigger than the last two we were on. That's cool. There's different size maps. They're not all tiny. General store. Can't open the door, can we? Oh. What's wrong? Thought I'd never see where those irons again, bounty hunter. I have unlimited ammo, right? I don't know. No, I don't. I have. Oh, fuck. I see now. I do have ammo. It is on the bottom where my gun is down there. Uh. Is my camera in the right place? It's covering the map. I don't know if you guys care to see the map. Whatever. It's good. I'm going to see if I can just walk away after opening instead of... Ooh, chest. Oh, dude. Sturdy deer hide vest. That's cool. Vests. It won't stop a bullet, but it might save your life. Vests increase your armor, reducing the amount of damage you take. You can buy cheap vests at dagger and bone shops in most towns, while trapper camps will provide high-quality vests. Okay, cool. No, nope, I want to get the coins and gold nugget. Ooh, that was a good find, dude. I'm gonna shot the place down. Oh, can I? Can I just shoot it? Did that work? Hmm. Requires one lock pick. Did that say skill? Like level one? No, I just need one lock pick. Okay. And it was red, so it seems like I shouldn't do that. Everything else is fair game, apparently. Doesn't seem like I'm getting in trouble for picking this stuff. Man, this is fun. I like this game so far. I just like looting. And uh, games like Fallout, you know? It's fun stuff. I'm into RPGs. I could have stopped them. 
uh, I couldn't finish what she was saying. Let's go here and talk to these guys. Why are they? They sound so weird when they're talking. Uh, let's go talk to the... Floods, gotta say it. It's good to see you wearing shooting irons again. That farmer's life never did suit you. Now let's give this still water bastard the squeeze. You tell us what we wanna know. We'll only break a few fingers. Leave you enough to scratch your ass with. Y'all used to run ammunition, not abduct people. What's different? Kiss my ass, law hound. I ain't telling you cuss. See, thing is, when your voice shakes like that, I don't find you convincing. You find him convincing, partner? Why don't you turn the screw on this asshole? We can ask nicely, threaten him, or break his pinky. Let's threaten him. Mm, no, let's ask nicely. You, you don't understand. I tell you, he, he'll do worse than kill me. He, he'll eat me. Oh shit. That was creepy. Uh, promise to protect him from harm. Threaten to give him to the angry town's folk. Break his pinky. Uh, let's promise to protect him from harm. You, you will? Yeah, but even if I m made it out of here, he'd find me. Maybe these bars is my best bet. All right. Our old boss, Pop Stillwater, he's gone. We got a new boss. It's Shelby Cross. Shelby Cross? Floods Almighty, he ain't no man. He's a siren. They ain't normal. They, they eat people. I've been trying to track down Cross for years. Now we're close enough. I can smell the cannibal bastard. Where'd Cross run off to, huh? Where'd he take Jane's husband? I tell you and you p p promise you keep me safe? Guarantee his safety. Let's go easy on him. You... You really think these bars is so strong enough? You'll keep keep watch. Lock and key. Yeah, yeah but help me. All right. After I hit on Grackle, we were all meeting up at the camp. It's five hours northwest towards Offerton Valley. You hurry. You m might catch him. You might still catch him. Well now, you played him like a fiddle on Blues Night. Trail's hot, no time to lose. I'll holler on that relay if I hear if I learn anything useful. I gotta stay here. Keep the town safe. You give him floods out at that stillwater camp, you hear? So Alright. It's sirens who took your husband. Flesh eaters. Best find that Stillwater camp while your husband still got blood in it. Can we take a horse? No, I can't take a horse. Ink pen. Let's take it. You got something to say? Heather Morris. Jane, it's my husband Isaac, the blacksmith. Them Stillwaters took him. He was screaming and I couldn't do nothing. You, you're wearing your bounty hunter gear again. Never thought I'd see the day you headed after him. Say so you are, they took your husband. So you aim to find him? If you, if you come across my Isaac, make sure he comes home safe. I'd give you anything. I, oh, how about my pistol? You'll need good odds for your work, won't you? Please. 
sure, we'll look for him. Why not? You've always been a good woman. I bet he'll be locked up with the rest of them. Keep your ears open. I bet he'll call out if he sees you. I ain't got much left for my pistol. But it's yours if you bring my sweetheart home. When did the world get so dark? Damn. This is a dark wild west. Dark weird west. <laughs> hey. Just kidding. I'm not funny. Alright. Should we leave yet? Or should we check out some stuff first? I don't know. Oh, she's taking a shit. <laughs> the hell? Um, let's go check up here real quick. Oh, nothing to see. How about up here? No. Nothing up here. Ooh, that hurt me a little bit. No, no, not really. Um, can't take this horse. So, I think we got five days left to catch, to find the blacksmith's hus, the blacksmith, that lady's husband. Hmm, I guess we should go, get going, you know, got shit to do. We gotta get moving, man. Belsta, that's where I... Stillwater Camp. Stillwater tracks seem to lead through here. You'll need to pick up the trail again if you hope to find them. Pick up Stillwater's trail at the Wilderness Camp. Alright. What's this? Traveling mercenaries. Merchants. Merchants stop by the side of the road to rest on the way to the next town. Okay. Let's check it out. We sell some junk. Ah, peaceful sight for once. How much money do I have? I don't know. Let's see. Ain't me alright. Ain't much money out here. But even a dirt poor, a dirt poor farmer needs to fresh tools now and then. Looking to trade. Um, yeah, let's see. So, um, sell all junk. G. Cool. Let's sell. Let's not sell a shovel because um has durability. So if we run out of one shovel. I want to have another one so that we can keep digging if we need to, you know. How much money do I got? 73? Okay. Um, let's buy one lockpick. Cool. That's all I really want to buy right now. Wait. Don't I have bandages? Oh, I guess I can't sell them, huh? I got two bandages. Let's buy one more. Alright, I think that's it for now. It's the beginning of the game and I want to spend all my money on shit that I don't really know if I need. So let's go back to the map. Let's see if this location, Albrightstead. So Fiber and his family built this home with their own hands. I mean, we could check it out, I guess. I don't know if we really need to be here. But why not, you know? Hey, good weather. Maybe I'll go for a walk. Just keep our heads down. Why did he do that? <laughs> hmm. Watch where you're going. Um. Yeah, I don't think I need to be here. I'm gonna take off already. <laughs> Let's go this way make our way towards the Stillwater camp and see what we can f hunting grounds Tr 
travel and camp. Mm. Let's try traveling camping. Oh, hunting for food. You've made camp. Check the main map for nearby animals. Neutral critter neutral critters will appear as gray dots. Hostiles as red. Hunt f them for raw food. Some can even be skinned for hides, as you've got a skinning tools. Die. Hides and leather vests. Person can be skinned. Tool bags for the hides. Interact with them. Can be sold at trapper camps. They're used to make vests. Okay, cool. Let's get a couple of these things. Do a little hunting. Just a little bit of hunting. What are those? Coyote? Oh, that was cool. <laughs> Combat's cool in this game, man. I like it already. Alright, so we're getting raw meat from these guys. No hides or nothing. That's fine. I don't mind about that. I don't need hides. I don't really need anything right now. All, all I know that I need is to move on to the next area. But I can cook some stuff. Do a little cooking. Heal up. That's nice. Alright. We're looking good. Things are looking pretty good for now. Uh oh. What's the hostile? A snake? I'm not too worried about a snake. Let's just go. Fuck him. I don't need a snake. Let's get out of here. Let's go to Stillwater Camp. Alright. See what we got here now. Take that meat. Thank you. Oh, space to jump. Oh. Oh, cool. Oh, this is an enemy, I'm assuming. Knocking enemies unconscious. Unaware enemies can be knocked out by pressing and holding in melee range. Unaware enemies will also take extra damage from all your weapons. Cool. So it's kind of like Skyrim stealth rules or any kind of RPG stealth rules, basically. In a bush, they can't see you, and it tells you. Cool. So you can hide bodies in. The... That's good. I'm sure that like uh, visibility affects stealth. Like having a torch blown out probably helps me stay stealthy. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense. Oh, dude, this is. This feels like an arcade game. Arcane game. With the stealth and shit. Let's knock this dude out. We don't need to kill him. I always like to knock people out if I don't have to kill him, you know? It feels morally right, I guess. I don't know. Maybe. I think it feels like a special way of taking care of enemies because you're always, you're always killing people in video games so when you have an option to knock them out it feels different so I like doing that switching weapons you found a weapon of a new weapon type hold left alt to open the weapon wheel and switch between weapons you can also perform a single tap on 
left alt to switch back to your previous weapon. Okay. Alright, I don't like left alt. I'm gonna probably just change that to like the mouse button. The middle mouse button. Let's check this out. Got a rifle. Sick. I'm stoked about this rifle. Should I shoot him? Fuck it. Let's go. Got one of them. Nice. This combat feels good. Can't I? Ooh, nice. Ah, oh, man. I gotta get better at that, though. Scrapping ranged weapons. You already own a weapon of this category. You can resell your extra weapons at any weaponsmith in town, or you can, if you're desperate for bullets and weapon crafting material, interact with a ranged weapon in any inventory to scrap it. Scrapping a weapon gives you a chance to scavenge ammo from its magazine. And if you're lucky, you can get some reusable materials out of it, like copper, silver, or gold nuggets, depending on the weapon. Note that you can only scrap ranged weapons. Okay, cool. Why not, like, shovels or some shit? I don't know. I don't care, it's fine. Quill and medley spirit touch. What is that? Revolver, okay. Sick. Can I see that? Oh, I got old blue instead. That's fine. I'm gonna switch to old blue. I barely gotta use it. Take their meat. I'm stealthing all the way through this, man. Oh, dynamite. If I distract them, maybe they'll come check it out. And then I can shoot the dynamite. I'm gonna try that. Okay, so I don't think that worked to distract them. Hmm. I don't know what I should do. Oh, I know what to do. Alright, here we go. Watch this. I wonder if they're gonna hear me. Or if the guy fixing the wheel is gonna hear me if I knock this person out right in front of me. Get a better view. Nope, they didn't hear me. Let's drop them right here. This is cool. And then knock you out. Next. Boom. Dude. I'm straight up salt snake right now. That's how I feel. This, this feels like a Hitman or like Metal Gear Solid game. <laughs> it's fun though. I like it, man. It's cool. Oh, I got some bandages and rope. Oh, nice. Dynamite. Dynamite. Let's get out of stealth and go pick up this dynamite over here. Cool. And some tongs. Very nice. You can climb in this game. Kinda. <laughs> Alright. Look at my map. Looks like there's nothing over here. Except for a grave. I can dig. Oh, we're digging up someone's grave. I don't want to take someone's bone. I'll take the sheriff star, I guess. Sell for scrap. It's worth a lot. How about over here? Nothing. All right, it's cool. Quick saving and experimenting. 
I'm well aware of what this is. I'm a Dishonored fan. Quick saving experimenting is something you do a lot in those games. If you've ever played Dishonored or Prey, there's multiple ways to approach different kind of uh, combat situations and just stealth and all that, you know? Yeah, so that's what they're talking about right here. If you want to experiment with new or risky approach, nothing is off the table in Weird West. From sneaking through a map fully unnoticed, traveling to locations you might not be ready for, or even putting important story characters in the dirt, you'll always be able to complete your journey on one way or another. However, you might want a quick save prior to trying anything risky as an opportune death an opportune death waits for those unprepared for the challenge. Okay. Cool. How do you just save? I like to just save. You see. Quick save's cool. But I don't memorize where F five is, so You know what? I actually think I'm gonna call it there. Leave it on like a little cliffhanger. Sorry. But maybe you'll want to watch next time. I think we're about to f confront most of the people that are responsible for taking our husband and that girl's husband. At least I hope we are. I want to kill those fuckers. Alright. Anyways. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video and you actually want to see the next video, then I recommend you subscribe and click the bell so that you'll be actually notified when I upload the next episode. If not, that's cool. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.